Welcome back to Isaiah 61. My name is Pastor Solomon Aquaka, Senior Pastor, Spirit of the Lord Church. We are 1001 Penn Avenue North, Minneapolis, Minnesota 55411. We believe in the mandate of preaching the good news and making disciples and, and using every gifting that God has deposited in, in us for the edification of the body of Christ. So join us Sundays at 10.30 a.m. for uh, an encounter with God, authentic worship, and a now word. I have with me here <coughs> Prophet Samuel Frimpong, all the way from Ghana, a seasoned man of God in the ministry, and God has been using him mightily across the globe. And and Prophet, you wanted to say something. Yes, um, I was saying that uh, in miracle workings, it is God who chooses how he does it. The how is all about him. Yeah. Because we see in the ministry of Jesus, he sees one blind man, he, he just prays for him, and the blind man's eyes is open. He sees another blind man, and he didn't just pray, but this time he spat, mixed it with sand, applied it on the eyes, then he asked him to go and wash it. And he goes to wash it, and the eyes are open. So he realized that same miracle, but mm. different methods. Yes. Yes. And the method is all about how God wants to do it. Yes. All about how God wants to do it. Mm. So which means that it's not a cookie cutter. It, mm. Because he did it this way yesterday, mm. he's mm. going to do it that is the it. same. But that he would do it, but mm. maybe not in the same manner. That is it. That's profound. Mm. So you're, you're in a situation, you're at a crossroads in life where... You are seeking God for a breakthrough. You're mm. seeking the voice of God and the mind of God to be manifested in your situation. Mm. It is not impossible. Mm. Just trust God. Mm. And so, Prophet, I, 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 I know you, you're going to speak to us about um, Jesus has the final say. Mm. And in the, in the example you gave about the woman that was pregnant for over mm. three years, mm. Jesus had the final say and gave you a word mm. that in two weeks she shall deliver. deliver. For those that doubt, based on their circumstances, based on mm. their experiences, based on how life has treated them, mm. that there is probably no hope and and they, there is not much to anticipate. Mm. Can you speak a word to into mm -hmm. their lives? Wonderful. Jesus said, blessed are those who have not seen but yet believes. To walk and experience God is all about believing in him. Doubt cannot work with God. It is faith that works with God. Yes. Uh -huh. So uh, I want to entreat every one of us that it is about time we switch to faith. Because it is only faith that can make us experience God and experience him to the fullest. Yes. The Bible says that, and Abraham walked patiently with mm, God he did. and experienced the promise. He saw the promise. He saw the promise manifest. Uh -huh. So faith is patience. If you have faith, you walk with God in patience. And God honors whatever he has said Amen. in your life. Amen. One thing is that the promises of God never fails. They never. He never fails on his promise. He said to Isaiah in Isaiah 55, he said, I do not send my word. To return back to me void mm. but it comes to fulfill the purpose for which i sent it so whenever god says he will do something he does it he does it yeah. just believe no matter how long it will take he told habakkuk write the vision and make it plain on tablet that those who are running can even see and read mm. it even though it tarries it will come, to, will pass. come to pass that means that no matter what will happen to the purpose of god yes. it will still come to pass yes. the devil can't stop it from manifesting yes mm. wow wow Wow, that's powerful. And and as you go through the challenges in life, know that Jesus had the, has the final he say the to final everything. Say. Mm. And so I I want us to release a, a now prayer mm. for those that are going through, those that have been diagnosed with mm. sicknesses and, and some diseases that mm. there may not be a cure for, or they're they it's taking a toll on their lives. Mm. It's it's, it's cause some chaos in mm. their families we're gonna lift up prayer for them Hallelujah. in the name of jesus in the name man of, of god jesus. just make some declarations over Glory. the lives